Hey. So, I am mowing the grass, or attempting to. And when I came onto the garage this morning to check and see if we had any more cat litter because I need more, um, I noticed that there was a roach in my garage. Albeit it was by the door over here, okay? I'm trying to put my boots back on. And hey y'all and good morning. Welcome to our gray house vlogs. But anyway, um, so I noticed that there was a roach. Okay, y'all, I don't do bugs. I don't do roaches, I don't do bugs. In general, I might be able to help a cricket outside or something like that, but in general, me and bugs, we're not best friends, right? So, uh, already I'm kind of like, because mm, I don't like bugs. And then, I start mowing the grass. I'm just mowing the main parts of the grass. Marvin's going to have to finish it up anyway. It's going to take him some time. I'm probably creating more work than, than whatever, but... So, we live next door to a jack-in-the-box, okay? Jack-in-the-box dumpster is right next to our fence. So, I'm mowing against the fence. Y'all know, know where this is going. So, I'm up mowing against the fence. And it's getting a little bit deep there. So, I knew Marvin was really, he really should weed eat first, or I should weed eat first before, you know. But anyway. So I'm like, I'm like pushing the mower, pushing the mower a little bit. I look over. Y'all, there was a rat. And Marvin had told me that one day there was a rat in his truck, like on the hood or whatever. And I know, you know, I mean, people live out in the country probably used to that kind of stuff anyway, uh, or, or worse perhaps. I am not. This is not, mm -mm. like the roach in general in the garage is like, we may have to burn it down. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we better not find spiders. We found a couple spiders. Ooh, no, don't like spiders either. So, but the rat. Oh, I don't even know, what, I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I told Marvin he's gonna have to mow that side of the yard. So that, that took care of that problem. So I'm gonna finish mowing the front of the yard and then I'm going to um, freshen up because the marketplace is today and it starts in about an hour. So I'm going to freshen up, go walk across to the marketplace and try to rid my mind of the thought of the rat. Ugh. It was, oh y'all, mm -mm, mm -mm. y'all that are used to it or see it on a regular basis and it doesn't phase you, you are strong people. You are strong people. but. I am not. So, anyway, I'm gonna go finish the front yard because I did leave it just half done, and that's not good, because um, that just looks wonky. So I, need, I at least need to do the part that people drive by and see, you know? So I'm gonna go finish that part, but, oh my gosh. Now I'm just like all feeling, Ugh, you know? Like, uh, uh Anyway, okay, let's go finish the yard, y'all and hope the rats haven't taken over my lawnmower. If I see another one, y'all, <laughs> y'all may hear me from where y'all are at screaming. Seriously. Whew. Y'all, I'm hot and tired, but I'm sure I got in some steps, although I didn't carry my phone with me. So, pff, we're not gonna know how many steps I got, probably a million. And now I gotta figure out how to put the lawnmower back after it cools down a little bit and um get myself something to drink and hmm, i think that's it i think that's all so today is the marketplace i'm gonna set you down actually I'm gonna stay kind of so that's a little too high Is that better i don't know so today the marketplace at mesquite is happening and it's literally one block down and then one block over from where I'm at right now. So I'm gonna go there. I'm gonna cool down for a little bit. Right now it starts at, it's from nine to two, but and it's uh, 8.44 right now. So I figure I'll cool down a little bit and I'll put on my CJLA hat. I think I have the Ventura actually. And then um, 
a dress or something because usually in the summer when it's hot in Texas I wear more dresses and skirts because um, like it's not always appropriate for me to wear shorts to work but I can wear a dress <laughs> and dresses are cool so and I'm cool <laughs> you know what I'm saying but uh, so I'll probably put on a dress in my CJLA hat that I have never worn it's a perfect day for it it's sunny outside and but it's black I do buy a lot of black, which this, the heat is attracted to the black or something like that, but you know, whatever. And um, see what goodies see if they have any different vendors than I'm used to over there. And then I'm going to work on editing videos and cleaning up my house because on Wednesday we have book club and people are coming over my house. And it's, it's not gonna be all decorated for sure, not any more than it's decorated today, which it's not. So, but I mean, I can like put stuff away I have some like paperwork that needs to be filed and I've just had it sitting out on this, you know, credenza thing and so I'm going to put all that stuff away, clean both bathrooms, or at least clean the guest bathrooms because we don't really use those that much. And then, um, yeah, plan what I'm going to make for when they come over because they're bringing snacky foods but I don't know what kind of snacky foods I want to bring um, or have on hand. So, but anyway. Oh my lanta, it's hot outside. I wonder how hot it is. How hot is it? Let's check. So, Weather Channel says only 75. <laughs> Feels like 80, like 8,000. It says it is 75 degrees, and really it feels hotter because it's so humid. What is the, um, isn't it supposed to tell you like the feels like? You know what I'm saying? Saturday, we're gonna get to a height of 91 and plenty of sunshine high of 91 degrees fahrenheit winds north northeast at five to ten miles per hour perfectly hot day for the marketplace but i'm excited about it I'm trying to think if there's anything else on my calendar today got the marketplace oh summer sizzle awesome so each year we have kind of like a summer fest or whatever we call it summer sizzle and it's out at pasco park which is not too far away pasco parks that way actually anyway it's over by pasco park and they have free fireworks at the end um like a 20 minute show so that's always a lot of fun they have bounce house they have just tons of stuff for the kids and they have food vendors and just activities so we have not been in several years maybe a little bit hot for us to go out but um we're going to try and i say too hot for us to go out because um marvin gets affected by the heat so we always want to be careful I'm rambling, so now I'm gonna go and get some water to hydrate. Freshen up, take a shower, freshen up, and then go over to the marketplace, and I'll take you with me. I've cooled down. It's 9.25 now, and market started about nine o'clock. Sometimes some of the booths and vendors open early, but um, let's see the alarm. Did not make my bed yet. So I think I'm gonna wash my sheets really quick too. Not really quick, because my washer doesn't doesn't wash really quick. My washer takes time, I don't know. Does yours? Maybe it's just mine. Okay, so I'm gonna put this stuff in the washer, I'm gonna go take a shower, I'm gonna get dressed, and then we're gonna go to the marketplace, and we're gonna have an awesome day, and I'm gonna wear my hat, and I'm gonna try not to be self-conscious about it, because I love the idea of wearing hats. I see people wearing hats. I think I wanna wear a hat. I'm like, oh, that looks cute. I wanna wear a hat too. I'm gonna wear a hat today, May not be the perfect look for me, but it's what we're gonna do. Heading downtown to the Mesquite Marketplace. I'm just walking because it's a couple blocks from my house and a good walk never hurt anyone anyway, so. I'm wearing my new CJ LA hat. I think it's the Ventura hat and I love it. As I was saying earlier, I'm not really, I like to wear hats, but I never wear hats. And so I'm not gonna become like truly a hat person until you just start doing it. So I'm gonna start wearing hats and it's gonna be a thing. Now, I don't know if it'll be a thing or not, but I like wearing them, so. I'm just gonna start wearing them more because I have several that are in my closet. Just don't wear them and that's a waste. So I have on a garage sale dress. Bought it for a dollar. What? And then just my 
white cardigan, sandals. And I've got a tote bag with me because last time, the bags they gave me, like, I swear it was gonna cut off my hand. So, I'm gonna go see what fun things I can find. Probably go to the coffee shop and get a hot chocolate and then walk around and see what goodies there are to be had today. Hey guys, I just bought my lemon cake from Heavy Hands Bakery. There she is, what? Y'all come and see her. <laughs> Heading home after spending a little bit of cash at the marketplace, I got a two pineapple upside down cupcakes. I got some peaches, or Marvin got some peaches. And I got, oh, a lemon cake. And I got these things that are like magic cookie bars, but they're not, they're like cookies but instead of bars, but they're essentially the same thing, or at least they taste the same to me. And I like those, so I got those. I thought somebody was following me. Oh, <laughs> it was my bag making a noise. I'm like, somebody's behind me. I need to be careful. So like I said, I just live a few blocks away. And I'm headed home, Marvin's already home. He joined me at the marketplace and we just sat on a bench for a little bit and then he said I'm gonna go home and eat and anyway so now he's home ahead of me and I'm heading home I was sweating though my goodness it's hot outside it's supposed to get up to 91 degrees today yay Texas there is the summer sizzle tonight and it starts at 4 I believe but I don't think we're gonna go because it's just really hot and Kind of miserable when you get that hot but i'll see what mr Har says if we're gonna go or not because it does sound like it might be kind of fun like a little bit of fun but we'll see hey guys we did not go to summer sizzle but we live pretty close to the um park so maybe we can see the fireworks Hey y'all, it's almost 11.30 and I am getting ready for bed. I'm just actually backing up my computer. So what I do is I put everything on one hard drive and then I, um, it's making sure I was in focus. So then I back up to a primary backup, okay? And I do this, I try to do this once a month. And then I back up also to a backup to the backup and here's why because one time my backup failed and I lost some stuff not not a whole bunch of stuff just a little bit of stuff but I lost some stuff so I back up everything's on a hard drive and I back up to a primary backup and I back back up to a backup so if that's not like overkill I don't know what it is so I figure if after all three of those things if they all fail just was meant to be but I have made or uploaded all the videos that I had currently stored in the one backup uh, on my on my iMovie stuff I mean that means I can clear those out after I finish backing up of course but I can clear them out and then I can start um, what do you call it uh, I can like clean those off and then I can put a new batch on and start editing and uploading those. I uploaded like five or six videos today, which I know is a lot. One of them didn't even have any views and that's okay because primarily I am uploading right now more for my benefit because I want to be able to look back and be like, oh yeah, the build process or how small Captain was or how small Socks was and stuff like that. So it's more really honestly it's more, really more for me and I, I just enjoy making videos and so I want to get to the point where I'm all caught up and then I can make some sit down videos like DIYs craft videos um, and things like that because I'm getting really inspired by some of these gals that I've been watching on YouTube so but I don't want to I don't want to start any new things like that until I've finished uploading all of my vlogs and I got caught up so that's what I'm gonna do and 
figure out how to uh, do some other stuff. But anyway, that's kind of where I'm at right now. We had a lot of fun. Did I tell you that there was fireworks? I think I did. Anyway, we were outside and we walked down to the end of the street and it was a much better view. And it would have been awesome if that truck hadn't been there with the light, but it was. But it's okay because next time we ever have fireworks out at Pasco Park, we'll know we can just go to the end of the street and have a really great view of those. Um, tomorrow we are going to church and then after church, um, we're going to go to Jonathan's place or diner or whatever it's called for brunch. We haven't been to brunch in forever and we used to love to go to brunch and we would check out the D magazines, best brunch spots and all that kind of stuff. So we really like brunch. So that's the plan. We're going to go tomorrow to brunch with Carrie and Gavin. And then I think that's it for tomorrow. To, oh, I'm gonna go show a house about four o'clock. And so that'll be awesome. Hopefully she'll like it and she'll get it because she lost that on the, the other house. I showed her two houses the other day and um, she really liked one, but then she didn't make an application and somebody else did and they got it. So it's the way the cookie crumbles. But I have, um, I'm gonna um, show her a house tomorrow, but Today, I got up, I was almost attacked by a rat, <laughs> but uh, I mowed the grass, which was awesome, yay, go me, and then I went to the marketplace, and that was a lot of fun, and I wore my new CJLA hat, and I thought, I felt really cute, so you know how sometimes like, you feel really cute, anyway, I felt really cute, so um, I got to talk with some of the vendors, which I love connecting with people, it's always so much fun and trying to support the local community and the local small businesses that I come in contact with because I just feel like they're kind of like me. They're just trying to do what they love doing and, and make a living at it. So it was really kind of awesome. And then I came home, started editing some videos. And like I said, I got a bunch up. I'm going to get a bunch up tomorrow. I just know it. I feel like I'm on fire and I'm just waiting for this to back up. It says I have 23 minutes left but anyway i must stay up a little bit longer to do that because i can't shut this off because then it'll like it could like damage or um whatever with the files and stuff so i have to make sure that i um don't just shut it down so but anyway i'm gonna end the vlog now and take you with me tomorrow on all the things that i do tomorrow and I hope you guys have a great night. Don't forget to be kind to others. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.